I don't know who can relate to this, but I just want to say this. Wasps are one of the most dangerous and possibly the scariest arthropods that you will ever encounter. And even hornets. I hope I don't meet no hornet, but those guys, too. I mean, just think about it. you you walking around in a nice sunny day. You, you are thinking nothing much of the world, right? And then all of a sudden, you just get stung, like, a gazillion times. And then you end up finding out that you're getting stung by yellow jackets or those uh, gigantic uh, hornets. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it's safe to say their sting hurts, their buzzing hurts, their bite hurts, everything hurts. But what hurts the most is you being called a wasp, but you live in the ocean. How does that work? The sea wasp. And actually, believe it or not, they're box jellyfish. I didn't know that, but now I do. And now you do as well. They are not arthropods. They fall under the lines of the box jellyfish family group and they can grow up to 35 centimeters in the diameter. So I just learned this but they are called sea wasps because of their potent venom in their tentacles that feels like a billion wasps are like stinging you at the same time making these jellyfish one of the most dangerous Sindarians and I'm put the name on the top in the world. And with this potent venom that they have on these tentacles they will feed on small fish and other smaller organisms and I wouldn't even be surprised if they were going for even smaller jellyfish. Jellyfish at this point. And like many types of jellyfishes, they can reproduce both sexually and asexually by external fertilization. 